King News, my lovely, wonderful people, not be smarty the apple so. Uh, as uh, election they draw nearer so. Uh, our brother Wiki, he don't confess so. He don't they beg go. He say he never worked against uh, Peter Obio. He say not work against Peter Obi, not do amo. Remember that we produced it with a video where Peter Obi said the governor of River State worked against him. If you remember, please, if you have not seen that video, go on Apple Line Media on that video and see for yourself where he said that the governor of River State worked against him. He said because he knows that he won River State. He said he knows very well that he won River State. He's very sure that he won the election in River State. He said he's very sure of that. So this is exactly what is happening. This is exactly what is going on right now. You know, uh, Wiki himself is beginning to say that, you know, I cannot believe that this is happening. I can't just believe it. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. Wiki wants support. He wants people to come alongside with him, but he's not ready to do the, if it's, will you call it the right thing? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. I never worked against Peter Ruby or, that, or any other Southern candidate, Wiki declared. The River State Governor, Yesom Wiki, says he never worked against presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Ruby. Wiki, who spoke during a strategic meeting with petroleum marketers in River State, claimed he never plotted against any Southern presidential candidate during the February 25th presidential election. The governor, who was represented by his chief of staff, Emeka Wuki, claimed his position during the presidential election was based on the principles of equality, fairness, and justice. You can agree with me that there are a lot of insinuations and misinformation that His Excellency worked against the Labour Party presidential candidate. He never did anything of such and will never do it. I want to stand here to tell you, and of course, you know that His Excellency is a man who stands by his words. By the time, any time, any day, he speaks his mind and he will tell you exactly how he feels. His Excellency did not work against any Southern presidential candidate. The position of His Excellency is that of equality and, fa and fairness. There is election coming up and some people are trying to use it against him to say that he worked against Peter Obi in the state. The North has done their eight years and so it is the time for the South. That is His Excellency position. He did not hide it. He spoke about it. And so my brother... My brothers, there is nothing to shy away from because our land, our hands are clean. We call on the people of River State to vote for the PDP candidates in our state. Daily Post reports that the event had in, a, in attendance national leadership and members of the Petroleum Products Retail Athlet Owners Association of Nigeria, the Independent Petroleum Marketers Association of Nigeria, and the Nigerian Union of Petroleum, Petroleum and Natural Gas Workers. So there, he had to speak, he had to plead with the people uh, because <clears throat> things are becoming very tough for him now. You know, people... Some people are waiting for him. Apparently, they said they worked against their candidates and they are waiting to, you know, they say one good turn deserve that, deserves another. They are ready to return the favor in no distant time to show to him that we hear you loud and clear. We see what you have done and we are ready to take the bull by the horn. That which you did, we saw it. And that the way you went about things, how you worked against Peter Obi, we are very much aware of it. We are watching and then we are going to do copy and paste. Uh -huh. When the time comes, you will see for yourself. So he has raised up an alarm saying, I did, I did nothing of such. Uh -huh. Those of you planning against me, I did nothing of such. So please, don't, uh, don't speak against me. Don't work against me. And what have you. So these are some of the issues currently ongoing. These are some of the issues. And every single one of us can see for ourselves. Okay, every single one of us can see for ourselves. So our brother is coming up to say that those who are saying he worked against Peter Obi in a river state, that they are just saying that for political reasons because they, they don't want, you know, uh, obedience in the state to vote, 
you know, uh, you know, the PDP presidential candidate, but, you know, he's saying that they should vote because he supported Peter Obi. And if you listen to Wiki himself, he said, uh, when, yeah, Peter Obi wins, where Peter Obi comes first, the Tinubu will come second. Where Tinubu comes first, Peter Obi will come second. So that was how they did it. And it was a video. It was not uh, just hearsay. It was a clear video, you know, and he said this was what they did in the States and how they went about things. You know, and he stated it loud and clear. I mean, that's to tell you that there was more to it. You know, he stated loud and clear that, you know, he worked for the Southern. And however, that is very much being used against him now. As many people can tell you for, for, for sure that the actions he took was against Peter Obi, but he's here to defend his saying that no, he did not work against, he did not work against Peter Obi. Whatever anybody saw, you know, was uh, was just a figment of their imagination. Um, he did not work against Peter Obi as he, you know, really wanted a Southern and to win. <clears throat> but so many people said, you know, he he had other interests. He was he was peculiar. He was particular about who he would be supporting because he did not uh, he, he envisaged that you know the Southern and he's supporting you know one might win against the other and he does not want to be at the losing end and want to stay relevant in the corridor of power and so had to do all he can to ensure that he re 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 regain or retain his relevance but guess what even the very the very uh fundamental things he has put in place with uh you know with Sinubu are all falling down and come crashing because what we can hear right now is that some of those things are no longer you know are no longer uh standing some of the agreement they made he said they will allow you know a state river state to remain a pdp state so that means there are some things they do if they don't allow you you see why some people are really questioning the votes that we voted if really it was the it was the it was the election or it was something else this is why people are questioning the integrity of the just concluded election because they feel very strongly that some persons, you know, may have influenced this election, you know, to suit their way and to suit them in some certain angles and areas. So for whatever is worth, just remember that Nigerians, we all, we all have a duty to ensure that, you know, we do everything, humanly speaking, possible to change the course of what is going on today so that we can truly, okay, have the, the liberty for a better future and make sure that Nigeria changes and becomes a better place. If Nigeria is a better place, you, you will hardly find those who will be thinking of uh, just leaving the country without looking back. If we were honest, we will be, we'll be truthful. Bye for now.